All right, we've got two different guys, Woodland on the left and Keegan Bradley on the right. And they've got two different backswings, one that's flat and one that's a little steeper. But the one thing that both of these guys do going back is they keep the club in front of them, which stops the uh, left arm from over rolling or rotating, which actually just means it's not pronating. So on the backswing, the, the left arm can stay more in front of the body for Keegan. For Woodland, it's going to move a little bit more behind, but the club never got really behind him. And then here's Woodland at the top with his nice flat backswing, but then he's able to create a huge elbow move starting down. So, you know, again, tremendous athlete, can dunk a basketball, sometimes can make uh, these moves from from what most normal people could not make that movement from so what Robin's talking about here is at the top of the backswing that little um, top part where the club is starting to point a little bit what looks like a little cross the line is actually going to create a little bit of uh, internal rotation in that right shoulder so it doesn't stay totally externally rotated. It's actually going to go a little internal. And then that will create a stretch shortened cycle for the downswing move. Does that make sense? So if it goes IR at the top, setting off a little stretch shortened cycle for ER on the way down. And then he also mentioned uh, a little bit of abduction, which is the elbow kind of moving a little behind. And that's really normal for everyone. The, the problem is actually people pulling lawnmowers are abducting the right arm super early and, and way too much and it will disconnect the whole thing if not careful. So let me show you what that looks like. Okay, so here's a little better view of the arm abduction. So again, the right arm, if it, if it separates just a little bit away from the shoulder there, it's a real small movement. It's going to create a little stretch so that there is a little firing down in. Okay, now most amateurs are actually doing too much of this. And then, of course, there are some that are folding it and holding it in so much that it's starting to create an early IR and create an early uh, firing extension of the right arm. So basically, you've got to have a little bit of a give at the top so that there's some firing, stretch shortened cycle firings that you're creating to start that downswing.